All right, so if you came here from my other video, this is well, what to do when your server won't start in MinOS. And you can see here, I click start and nothing happens. And this is because by default, depending on what version of Minecraft you're running, you might not have the correct version of Java installed. So since I'm running on 1.12.2, I need Java 8. And this unfortunately comes with like Java 16 or 17. Um, if you're on Etrunaz Jail, it's a bit more difficult to install Java because you don't have apt-get because you're not actually Linux based. So you have to use a different command, which I'll show you right now. So what you want to do is go back to your TrueNAS and then open up the shell of your MinOS jail. And then you can uh, see what which version of Java you're on. You sorry, Java dash version. Is the and yeah, so I have Java 17 installed. If you're on a version 1.12.2 of Minecraft, you need Java 8. And I don't know the other versions, so just look it up if you need to. But yeah, what you need to do is you type package install package install dash y mpym this is like this install as dependencies i think open jdk 8 for java version 8 and you have to actually have to type dash jre for the java runtime environment you may or may not have to do this depending on how your setup is i'm not too sure it's really buggy so yeah, just try this one the start, and then maybe try the other one if this doesn't work. Or hit enter. Yeah, it takes a bit because it's installing Java. So after it's done installing, it gives you this warning. Um, I haven't had the do this yet, so it might be safe to ignore. So basically, this is warning you that if you reboot your uh, your server slash jail, that these settings won't save. Mine saved fine for some reason, but if it doesn't save for you. I'll have a link in the description of what to do. But anyway, so we go back to the MinOS. They recently added a feature where you can specify which version of Java your server runs on. And so then what you need to go is go back into the SSH. You go to servers. Um, if you follow my previous video, you know how to do this. Back, you go to servers. You go to the server that you want to, you just installed. And then it's in the server.config file, not server.properties, server.config. And here you can specify where the path of your Java installation is. And then the default one is this here. And then uh, default is like open JDK, whatever. So mine is open JDK 8 dash JRE. You can actually check where it is. If you go back to your shell, you do ls user slash local. And then you can hit tab a couple times. And you'll see I have 17 here and then 8 dash JRE. So yeah, 8-jre, then slash bin, slash java, and then control s to save. You go back to MinOS, and then if you hit start, this should run fine. All right, there we go. Uh, I give you this warning, but yeah, it's safe to ignore. Basically, it's just running. There's too many, <laughs> too many log files. But yeah, that's it. Hopefully that helps somebody. If you have any other tips, please leave them in the comments because I'm brand new to this myself. And yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.